The vaping fanatics over here at MyFreedomSmokes.com are always eager to stay on top of what's happening in the vape community. And it's common knowledge among vapers that SpinFuel.com is the best resource on the web for all things vaping. So in appreciation for SpinFuel's contributions to the vaping lifestyle, we thought we'd share our top five favorite SpinFuel articles and features. Hang on tight because we're about to drop some knowledge, courtesy of SpinFuel. Number five, the Vape Glossary. For new vapers, and not a few veterans, this thing is the Bible. SpinFuel's glossary of vaping terms puts all other e-sync glossaries to shame. I usually have my phone open with SpinFuel glossary, so when a buddy says something like, dude, my local B&M didn't have the DNA 200 and they want $20 for ego-style tanks, then they sold me a mutation-style RDA, but the heat sink sucks, and the grub screws won't hold on my clapdons, and the IMR 18650s they sold me for my hybrid neck mod and my squonker are terrible. No way are they pulling 40 amps. I can translate that into English for any non-vapers in the office. So, if you're a noob or a non-vapor and you find yourself in a vaping discussion, open up SpinFuel's Vape Glossary and impress your friends with your vast knowledge of vape terms. Number four, gear reviews. Unlike some online gear reviewers who will remain unnamed, Team SpinFuel consistently puts out honest, comprehensive, and engaging gear reviews. No manufacturer owns these guys and girls. They give you the straight dope on everything they review. If it sucks, they say it sucks. They don't dance around a product's faults and only hype the pros. Plus, they use an A to F grading system so you're always going to get an apples to apples evaluation. Take Kiera Hartley Barnes' review of the Pro Ant Knight V1 mod and Talos tank. The mod was way too heavy and the tank coils didn't last, so it got a D grade. There were things she liked about the kit, but the cons outweighed the pros and the D-grade acknowledged that fact. Another great thing about Spin Fuel reviews is that they are well written and accompanied by a well produced video. If you've ever gone on YouTube for a vape review, you've seen the dude who doesn't know how to focus his camera, doesn't know how to light anything, doesn't edit, and really doesn't know much about vaping or the product he's reviewing. Spin Fuel has the most consistently excellent vaping reviews on the web. Number three. The news aggregator. SpinFuel is like Reddit for vapors. The crack news team at SpinFuel locates and links to the most relevant articles of interest to eSig users and always has fresh and current copy of its own. SpinFuel's Vape News tab is a one-stop rallying point for vapors to get the latest goings on in a foggy world. Especially now that the FDA has declared that it will begin regulating vaping, being an informed pro-vaping citizen is more important than ever. The best thing about SpinFuel's news aggregator is that it doesn't shield users from vaping news that is unpleasant or deleterious towards vaping. Everything is here, pro and con, and SpinFuel shows its respect for our intelligence by keeping it that way. Number two, the editorials. Going hand in hand with its excellent news hub, SpinFuel has a stable of vaping heavy hitters who contribute fantastic editorial content. Their opinion pieces cut through all of the misinformation and double talk and drive at the heart of issues of its great importance to vapors. Vaping gurus like Mark Benson and Julie Selznick are frequent contributors and guest contributions offer a look at vaping from people worldwide. Do you have something to say about vaping? Do you have a talent for expressing your opinions in writing? Maybe you can write something for Spin Fuel someday. Number one, the knowledge base. Anyone who is new to vaping or thinking about putting down the smokes and picking up a mod needs to visit SpinFuel's knowledge base. There is no better learning tool anywhere, not even close. An hour on SpinFuel's knowledge base is like four years at Vape University. You'll come away with the information and confidence you need to pick out your first device and join a wonderful club. And the knowledge base isn't just for newbies. Hey, Mr. Temperature Control, how much do you really know about temperature coefficients of resistance? Can you recite Ohm's law? It's voltage equals resistance over amp. No, wait. Better check with spin fuel.